oh Tom you must be really gutted with that late goal but just speaking to the manager and he's very proud of your performance yeah no there's a lot of positives we can take from that I think we're the better team for the vast majority of the game and we've been so well at defending our box all season um, so it's disappointing to concede the goal in that way but yeah we we were very positive after that and, and although we didn't get three points it's um it's a great result away at Notts County and it was a really hard working performance from all of you guys wasn't it yeah no that's something that we all buy into and we all do it for each other we, we run our legs into the ground and we know that you know when we get taken off that someone else is going to come on and do the exact same job so we'll, we'll give absolutely everything every game and and hopefully the outcomes then three points and talking about putting bodies on the line you were a bit battered at the end of that game you went off limping and everything okay yeah no all good just um another foul he didn't give I uh, got caught on on the foot but <laughs> You know, it's part and parcel of the game. I'm, I'm in a position where I'm going to get bumps and bruises. So if I don't expect them, then, you know, I'm in the wrong job. <laughs> <laughs> it just feels like you're so close to really getting these good results against very good teams. Yeah, 100%. I think if you look at our performances against the uh, top half of the table this season, we, we've had some really good results against them. So, you know, we, need, we just need to take positives from each game, use them and, and go on to Dagenham now on Tuesday and, and be ready to go and get a win. Defensively, you guys look so solid, don't you? We just need to score more than one goal in a game. Yeah, definitely. I think that's the frustrating part um, for us boys up top is that you know we're, we're all working so hard, and, and I think that the final bit is the the final third, the last bit in front of goal. So, but I'm sure when one comes, you know the floodgates will open and we'll all start scoring and, and flying. So yeah, fingers crossed that you know, at the end of the season we, we give it a real good go and, and the goals come. And the manager talks about you guys and team spirit and that you're building a really special group. Is that how you guys feel in the changing room? Yeah, I'm sure. I, I love it. I love the dressing room that everyone, every one of us are, are buying into the exact same thing and we all want the same outcome. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's a brilliant. We all get on, on well on and off the pitch. And, you know, when, when the results start coming on the pitch, you know, we'll, we'll fly, I'm sure of it. And that was three long trips. We've both made the long trips and then yeah. back to Hewish Park on Tuesday. It must be a bit of a relief. Yeah, definitely. You know, the, the fans really get behind us there and um, we'll definitely want to put on a show for them. And, and you know, the ones that travel, we're, we're so thankful for their support because, you know, Nottingham is, isn't the, exactly around the corner from the Oval, um, nor is Chesterfield. So, uh, <laughs> no, the, the, the support's been brilliant the past couple of weeks and we, we do really appreciate it. So, yeah, hopefully get back in front of our home fans and, and put on a show. And you're also getting some players back. Lawson Diath, of course, and Alex Bradley, who got his yeah. first goal. It's great to have those players back and adding to your squad. Yeah, of course, because you know the, the more competitive the squad is, the more we're going to push each other. Because you know people are going to keep their shirts each week. So for us to have competition all over the pitch now, it's brilliant, and, and we just keep pushing and keep getting better. So you know, as long as we all stay fit and, and positive, who, who knows what can happen between the, now and the end of the season. And I've got to talk about that front three. There's a lot of different personnel that have come in, and a new one for Jordan Barnett up there. Yeah, no, he's, he, you know, wherever he plays, he puts in a shift. You know, you know what you're going to get from Jordan. Um, and me and Chaz, you know, we, we know we've played more or less up there the whole season. So, um, yeah, we, we know our jobs. And, and like I say, the last thing now is just that bit in front of goal. And, and Bradders took his goal brilliantly today. So the more we can all chip in and, and start scoring, you know, we'll, we'll turn these draws into, into wins for sure. Thanks for your time, Tom. Cheers. Thanks.